get a wash. Ooh, it's cold! The next most important thing to do is put your actual clothes on as you're going out. It might sound like madness when you can just wear these all day, but trust me, putting your jeans on and making yourself a little bit uncomfortable, it really helps to separate the start of the, the, you know, the morning from the action. And that's what we'll do now. Now believe me, I know that this step might seem quite minor, but mentally it's huge. Now I'm ready to rock. I've got my heart rate monitor on. I'm at 90 beats per minute. Oof. I've got my, my skinny jeans on, my white t-shirt, my hair. It's time right back. And we can now see the day. So let's go and seize the day. For the first 45 minutes as a professional web developer, I don't just open my screen and check into a load of code. First of all, I'll go to my Kanban board, update my tickets with any comments that I need to, check to see if anyone has asked any questions, open my work approved chat app, and prepare for our daily stand up meeting, which uh, I always sit down for. But, but it's basically just a little, little catch up on how you did the previous day and what today's plans are. 12 o'clock when I begin the daily migration down to the gym, the fitness and health exercise room. Oh. Oh. Obviously, genuinely, I wouldn't work out in my jeans, but uh, I'm making a special exception just for you guys. This one's serious, right? So we've had a bit of a break, we're getting back to work. Um, but, you know, working from home is a bit similar to working for yourself because you gotta be very self-motivated to stay on task. Um, one thing I, help, I find helps a lot is to stay organized. So step one for me is to organize my desktop into four different screens. First one, we have terminal, and maybe a virtual box running, you know, whatever process you need in there, um, and whatever whatever extra operating system in there if you need one. Uh, next screen we have Visual Studio Code, probably with a big screen of glyphs on it. Uh, the next screen we have a browser open. We might have, um, you know, some type of Kanban board on there where we're keeping track of what the work is, and then the next screen is the entertainment screen where we would have, you know, probably a podcast or something like that playing. Uh, this is a really effective setup for me. But Michael, what do you specifically do? Well, I don't want to get into too much detail in this video, but I'm sure we'll make another one later on in the year uh, talking about that. But a few examples might be animating a mini bag, uh, refactoring a navigation, or dealing with something to do with an API. Uh, it's all fairly standard front-end development work with a little bit of back-end stuff sprinkled in there for fun. With the end of the work day approaching, it can be quite tempting to just have a little sit down, but nah. I'm going to throw on my running clothes and get that step count up. It's important for people who work from home to also work out from home. So for me this will be my second set of the day. But don't worry, I've got some exercise you can do right there in your chair. Smash the like button, hit the subscribe button. It's a real calorie burner. If you liked what you've seen here today, come back for more, I'll be posting soon.